Hi there, my name is John Stevens, pastor of Zion Lutheran Church in Oregon City, Oregon, and we're part of the ELCA, and this is Dollar Store Children's Sermons, where we take a look at the lectionary text and we tie them to an item from the dollar store. And so uh, this Sunday is the sixth Sunday after Epiphany, and we are looking at the second lesson, which is from 1 Corinthians. Again, kind of following up from last week, where Paul says, you know, is Christ cru- divided? Uh, is Was Paul crucified for you? Uh, you know, and... Um, we don't follow. Uh, we don't follow Peter. We don't follow Paul. We follow Christ, or Cephas, and we follow Christ. And so this Sunday, um, he takes off on that a little bit more. But uh, this idea that we each, each one of us, each uh, uh, person of God, has been given gifts. And there's times where I will do something, and someone else will come along and um, uh, will take that and use it. He uses the uh, analogy of planting where you plant a seed and so that one person plants and another person waters and another person tills, but God uh, causes the growth. And so what I'm using this Sunday is, um, and you, there's a couple of different items that you can use. Um, I got them from the dollar store and um, they each one of them works. If you have a, uh, a deck of alphabet cards at home, you could use them, or at the dollar store you can get blank index cards and you can write alphabet cards, or um, I found this die cut letters. Um, you'll need two of them, so it'll cost you two bucks, um, but uh, um, either that or spell a different word and we'll get there. I need one of these, or they have these alphabet puzzles where these pop out, and um, so it's pretty neat. Now the idea is is that with the alphabet puzzles or with this they're die cut and they pop out or the index cards um, that you can write on is you pop them out and again on this one you would need two of them because the idea is is that we're going to spell Jesus. Um, You could also spell God if you wanted to and you'd only need one of this uh, one of these, but um, but the idea of spelling Jesus that that you pop out the letters and you give one kid a J and the other an S and another S and a U and an E, and then have them have them stand there, and together, each has their own letter and you line them up and they're going to spell Jesus. That all of them together, as they come together, they make up the body of Jesus, the body of Christ. That God uses each one of our gifts to get the mission out there. And that when we come together, we become the body of Christ. And so playing off that, one person plants and another person waters and things like that. So that's that's the I, that's what I am using um, is um, these uh, puzzles um, or the die cut. Um, Or, like I said, you could take index cards and write A, B, C. You could write the whole alphabet, or you could have a stack of them, and that first, the first section of the stack can be the letters that spell Jesus, and you hand them out in random order, and then spell out Jesus, and show that each one of you is holding one letter, but all together, you spell out Jesus, or Christ, or God, if... uh, I think you get what I mean. So, all right. I appreciate you. Thanks for stopping by, and I hope you have a blessed week.